Disney gossip here, guys. Just a girl, leave me alone. No! Whoa. Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna be doing a very requested make routine. So I actually don't think it was requested, I'm just doing it anyway. Let's get into this video. Right now, that time of the month, I'm breaking out a little bit. Skin prep is so important. It'll help it come on smoother and not look patchy. First, I start with the Glow Recipe Toner. I feel like a watermelon right now. I like to mix bronzing drops in my moisturizer to give it like a tan, glowy look. Ooh. Mix it. As you can tell, very generous with it. I don't want to look pale, okay? Time of the month pain. The girlies get it. it happens to everyone, but every time it comes around, I'm like, what's going on? I'm so glad my period can stay. I don't really have anything today except for church. Like yesterday, I had a lot going on. I had a sleepover. I'm out with my friend. I went to Target. We walked a lot. It was so fun. But today, I had, luckily didn't have anything. Next, I'm going to use a little bit of this Super Goop Unseen Sunscreen because it's clear and doesn't leave a white cast. I love. A problem I've always had with sunscreen is sometimes I'll go like this and all of my skincare and makeup comes off. Luckily, this sunscreen doesn't do that, so that's why I really like it. My skin is nice and prepped. It's glowing. I like to use this incognito concealer. It's affordable and it blends really well. As you can tell, we're gonna need a little bit. I promise you my skin will like clear up in a little bit. Okay, my beauty blender is from Wet n Wild, I'm pretty sure. It's like maybe like $3. I see all the ones for like $20 and I'm like, what? This one literally gets the job done. It's almost cheaper. Come on guys. Save your money. I don't really save my money, so I can't be saying that. Before, I used to never wet my beauty blender. I was like, why would you wet your beauty blender? And I saw some people do it. I was like, wait, that would make my makeup blend a lot easier. If you're not wetting your beauty blender, do it. You can use like water, facial spray. I like to use setting spray. It just blends my makeup easier. I'll come back when my concealer's all blended. And she's blended. This concealer doesn't have the most coverage. Whoa. I just really like it. If you want something with more coverage, this isn't the one to go to. For blush, I like to either use my e.l.f. liquid blush or my Rare Beauty powder blush, I think. Okay, I'm gonna use my Rare Beauty powder blush. It's so beautiful. It's in the shade Happy. It's just glowy. Miss Selena knew what she was doing with this blush. If you don't know me, I'm a big Sabrina Carpenter girly, so I love her. I love her makeup. I'll put up my inspo pictures right here, but she uses a lot of glowy blushes. And Next for highlighter, I like to use this Rare Beauty one if I'm going for more of a full glam look. I'm going for a more everyday look. This e.l.f. Daily Dew Stick gets the job done. Look at that. It just makes me nice and glowy without looking like super heavy. Kind of just blend out with my fingers. Literally gorgeous. I'm just using my little mirror here. Next, we're gonna do some contour. I like to do contour not necessarily to like reshape my face. I like to use it to make me look more tan. I feel like it does do that. This one from e.l.f., the Halo Glow, is so good. I love it. I just put it right here, right here, here, here. A little bit everywhere. I always feel like my contour looks 10 times better when I blend it with a brush, not a beauty blender. It takes a little bit longer. My base makeup is all done. Now we just gotta set it and bake it. <laughs> Refreshing. Let's move on. While I do my mascara, I like to set it with the Milani Conceal and Perfect powder. This packaging makes me feel expensive. The packaging I don't love though. Like, what is this? Come on, Milani. Step up. I'm not a great setting powder girly. I kind of just do this. A little bit of that everywhere. My inspo here is Sabrina Carpenter, one of my favorite singers. She has so many hits. Sue Me, All Because I Liked a Boy, Nonsense, Opposite, Espresso. She did so good in Girl Meets World. Personally, I liked Maya over, what's the other girl's name? Riley. Like, Riley just seemed a little entitled to me. I don't know. It's the Disney gossip here, guys. Get this eyelash curler from e.l.f. They have another one. It's not good. Get this one. This one will curl. I was wearing mascara earlier. I really like this tubing mascara. I've had it since August. It has like nothing left. I will repurchase it soon, I promise. It's the Tartlet Tubing Mascara. My lashes are in fact lashing today. I really like to do my bottom lashes. I feel like it just makes my lashes look fuller. And sometimes I'll top it with the Falsies Lash Lift from Maybelline or just the CoverGirl. I think I'm gonna do this CoverGirl waterproof mascara on top. I'll repurchase her eventually, I pinky promise. 
Personally, I know I do kind of have spider lashes. Honestly, I don't hate the look, so I'm totally fine with it. You didn't do your mascara right. If it doesn't look like this, it's not all over your face, then you all- ah! Ah! The female rage is real. What is this? We're just gonna rub it in. Oh. Normally, I would use micellar water, but today we're just using a wipe because I'm just a girl, leave me alone. It's everywhere. Let's clean it up like I should be cleaning my room right now. When I remove my makeup sometimes, it removes them. my base makeup too. And next, I'm gonna blend out my powder a little bit. If I'm baking wrong, someone please let me know. Next, we're gonna be doing brows. I kind of just comb them out. I don't do much with my brows because honestly, like I know that bigger, more bushy eyebrows are kind of more in right now rather than like thin eyebrows. So honestly, I don't hate my eyebrows. I used to, I used to be like, why are they so out there? But now I'm just like, oh, they're out there. <laughs> Loving yourself does not depend on how you look. It's a mindset. If you want me to do more videos on that, just let me know. Next, we will be doing a lip. I always use different lip products. I like to start by either using a lip mask or like a lip balm. I like Aquaphor. Next to your girl, Summer Fridays. This stuff was expensive. I love it. Next, I'm gonna be doing the Tower 28 lip gloss this stuff is gorgeous normally i don't wear darker lip colors but this one i really like it should just look like this thank you so much for watching that's it bye guys